Hey there. Here's Mr. G. It don't look like me. Right there's actually Cosmo. Anyhow, uh, I thought he was going to give out a shout out. I don't believe he is. All right. This sign right here has got a, got a pretty good story behind it, which is true. Anyhow, right there she is. Today's shout out, I'm going to go on and give it, Moto Ramblings. He gave me a great shout out a good while back. I forgot to put him on the wall. I forgot to put JP1970 on the wall and Big Al's compound. They might be another or two I forgot. Not intentionally. No, sir. All these guys right here give me a great shout out. Said real nice things about me. Some of them have got me linked to their channel. And I really do appreciate each and every one of them. Easy Rider right there. If you watch any of Easy Rider's videos at the end of them, you'll see my channel pop up there. You just click on it and it'll take you right over to me. I really appreciate him. I appreciate each and every one of y'all. I really do. Those are all great channels. All right, I reckon I'm rolling the lights are flashing. Here I am, back over here in the, in the whatever corner you want to call it. Uh, that sign over there that I was talking about, I went down to the insurance company. I used to go every three months to pay my dad's insurance when he was living. That's the way he had it set up. Every time I'd go in, I'd ask that woman about that sign. I'd say, I'd really like to have that many one of them. Can you get me one of them? I don't need the frame, just get it. I put it in my building. I'd love to have it. I like it. Well, about the third time down there, I asked her. She said, you know, she said, you're something else. She said, you really do like it, don't you? I said, I sure do. She said, hold on a minute. She picks the phone up. She calls. Told them that I wanted one of them. She said, I've been meaning to check on it, so I keep putting them off. I've been a little busy. She said, yeah, he's a good customer. He sure is. And, uh, she got off the phone. She went over and pulled that off the wall. Said, here you go. I said, really? She said, yeah. They said, give it to you. That's why I sure do appreciate it. I come back. I was tickled to death. Brought my dad's receipt back where he paid his insurance for him. I had that sign. I said, look here what they give me. He said, they just pulled that off the wall and give it to you. I said, yeah. He said, Lord, I'd have never bummed them out of that. I said, I didn't bum them out of that. I said, I've been asking them about it. He said, yeah, he said, you bummed them out. I said, no, I didn't. He said, well, I do like that. He said, that's nice. I said, do you want one? He said, no. Don't you go down there and ask him that. He said, I'm telling you what's the truth. He said, you can talk to him about it out of anything. I know. I just told her I wanted one. I'm not particularly that one. She gave it to me. He said, yeah, you aggravated her to death. But anyhow, that's a true story. Every bit of that. Now, why I was there, Another thing happened, you can believe what part you want to do this. No boy come in. He told her he's needing some fire insurance. She said, you needing what? He said, fire insurance. She said, you mean fire? He said, whatever, like if it goes up in flames. I want to get the money and ride. He said, I moved in up on the creek. She said, you don't need that. Need that. She said, you need full coverage, I guess. She said, but what you're needing is flood insurance. He said, no. He said, I want fire insurance. He said, I ain't worried about no flood. She said, well, where you're at? So they has flooded there before. She said, you definitely need uh, flood insurance. He said, listen, lady. He said, I know you're smart and everything, and you know how to do your job. He said, but I have no idea how to start a flood. <laughs> and he all think about that right there. This has been Mr. G, 1965, and I appreciate each and every one of y'all. Hold, hold on, man. And I thank each and every one of y'all subscribe. And uh, if you can like her, give her a thumbs up. If you ain't subscribed, subscribe to it. I appreciate that. I really do. Pass her on to your friends. And right here has been Mr. Cosmo. And I'm sorry that he wasn't acting a little bit better for y'all. But he is a pretty good little dog. You know, he looks like Willie Nelson. He, I think he does. He got a little bit of white on him right there. A little gray coming on him. He's just a pup. But anyhow... I appreciate each and every one of you. And we'll catch you later. Uh-huh.